what's up everybody for the Winitachi here and welcome to a video a hearthstone video and you're probably like oh my gosh fam hearthstone really i haven't seen one of those in a while but anyways haha -ha, happy hollow's end has just adventured into hearthstone as you can tell by all of the basically halloween themed action going on with the login screen so the time has come and do you feel fear the hearthstone's hollow's end is here and basically it's the headless horseman um, as for those of you that don't know, Hearthstone is based off of the video game called World of Warcraft and there's an event in World of Warcraft which basically is based around uh, Halloween uh, during October and I believe it sniffs into November a little bit but I do know it is from October 24th to the November 6th in uh, Hearthstone and basically the Headless Horseman is the main character in World of Warcraft for this event. So if you dare to brave in the tavern decked in delightfully dreary hollows and decorations, then you'll find the horrific host has also planned some spine-tingling treats and chilling challenges. So this is a very, very fun event, and I really, really love this event in Hearthstone. Some new stuff coming in. So tempting treats once each week during the celebration. So there's going to be two weeks during the celebration. The Headless Horseman is handing out creepy card pack and an arena ticket just for logging in. So log in between October 24th to the 30th to receive two Whispers of the Old God card packs and an arena ticket, which I've already got. And then log in between the 31st and November 5th to receive two Knights of the Frozen Throne, which is the latest expansion card packs and an extra arena ticket. So you get to do the arena ticket twice and you get four free packs. So basically what's going on in this event is the Great Hollows End Arena Costume Party. During Hollows End, you can experience an all new dual class arena mode. With an added twist, each of the nine classic Hearthstone heroes will be attending in costume. And what that means is you get to dual class in uh, the arena. So when you start an arena dur uh, run during the Hollow's End, you'll choose a hero, then a hero power. And the cards offered in your packs or uh, from your picks will be um, from both of those classes. So basically you can go mage and choose the warlock hero power and you can choose mage and warlock basically cards. So, you're getting to get a hero that's going to be basically going in costume and attending in style, fam. There's also, of course, what event is it in Hearthstone without a tavern brawl? So a tricky tavern brawl, the Headless Horseman Rides. There's a special Hollow's End tavern brawl that will run from October 25th to the 28th. So it was just released today, even though the event started yesterday, and it'll expire on the 28th. So you got three days to do this. Um, the Headless Horseman has been marauding through the countryside, and it's up to you to stop him. You'll go in disguise to catch the fiend by surprise. After the brawl begins, you'll discover which costume you'll wear. Each costume uh, has its own deck featuring cards from several classes, and for the first time, a passive hero power that you'll need to make the most of if you want to succeed in taking the Sinister Spectre. So we'll also be doing that in this video as well. So we'll basically be taking uh, part in both the uh, special arena event as well as the tavern brawl. Alrighty, so we're here in the arena and it is an interesting arena because it's a Hallows End arena for these next two weeks um, You'll be able to get into this Hallows End arena and I got a cool selection of heroes to choose from Elfurian Storm Rage, which is a druid, Uther Lightbringer, which is a paladin, and Gul'dan, which is a warlock I'm gonna go with the warlock mainly because I'm interested in warlock and he absolutely looks really cool. And it looks like a priest warlock. But I get to choose the other uh, abilities that I can have. I can go warlock hunter, warlock major, warlock priest. And warlock priest sounds really cool. So I'm going to go ahead and do that for this week. Alright, let's go ahead and choose our cards. So without further ado, we got a summoner random minion. You discarded. Your 9 damage split. Copy a card from your opponent's deck. Add it to your hand. So again, you could choose either Warlock or Priest cards, and of course, there's a mixture of the regulars as well. Gain control of an enemy minion with two or less attack until the end of the turn. Um, restore five health here, a minion, and a hero, or a lifesteal. Lifesteal is pretty lit. Um, taunt, lifesteal, death rattle, destroy a random enemy minion. Yeah, that is really cool. Uh, discover a copy of a spell in your deck. I'll definitely go with shadows. 
Uh, Onyx Bishop, never seen this. Summon a friendly minion that died this game. Choose a friendly minion, summon a 1 1 copy of it. <clears throat> uh, spreading Nightmare is absolutely disaster. Let's go with uh, Possessed Villager. Uh, do I have bindings? I haven't selected this one yet. Give a friendly minion plus 3 health. Nope. Uh, let's go ahead and pick up the Lifesteal Acolyte. Uh, we got a double the minion. We got another Acolyte of Agony Lifesteal. That is really good. Um, I wish it was the other way around. Priest with the Warlock uh, hero power, spe with, especially with these cards. At the, end of your, at the start of your turn, deal 2 damage to this minion. Um, Talent Lifesteal. Okay, that's the 9. And then whenever your opponent casts a spell, add a coin to your hand. That could be good. Um, just 12 health. Wow. Okay. Um, yo, damage. That's definitely, I need that at least once. It's kind of what I was going for. I would definitely want to see that 12 again, though. If it's your opponent's turn, summon a 2 2 ghoul. Um, destroy a friendly minion. Okay, I'm going to take a silence because it's always definitely good to have. Uh, Bloodworm, nah. Let's go ahead and see what we can get. Embrace uh, the shadow. This turn, your healing effects deal damage instead. Uh, whenever your minion takes, whenever this minion takes, deal three to your hero, and then remove the top card of your opponent's stack. I'm gonna take this case. It could come in handy. Never. I uh, keep getting a spreading madness. I don't want to use that at all. Choose a friendly minion, destroy it, and they went. Okay. Whenever you play a card, remove the top three of your deck. Oh no. Silent at the start. Organ Greaser. Um, yeah, I guess I'll go with the Grease. Discover a minion that costs eight or more. Summon it. Oof. Oof. Destroy a minion. Oh, that could be really nice. Uh, definitely gonna go with the Murloc. Um, take control. Double. Firefly could be nice. Uh, copy three cards in your opponent's deck and add them to your hand. If a friendly minion dies when attacked, and if you are holding a dragon, I don't have any dragons. If you have a friendly minion that died this game, fucking spreading madness everywhere. Uh, deal 2 damage to all not murloc, then I'll go ahead and grab this. Uh, Bane of Doom, uh, give a random lifesteal minion in your hand, plus 2 plus 2. That could come in handy, I have a couple of lifesteal uh, minions, uh, battle cry. The restore 5 health, destroy a minion and one of your mana crystals, keep the drain soul action going on here. Um, Hellfire, it's like a big backup, um, this is really good, summon a 6-6 six, six ogre, and then restore 5 health, I'm going for bone bear for sure, keep it going with the life seals, uh, death battle deal 5 damage to your minion, so no chance, and then uh, summon a random minion. I'm not discarding anything, so I kind of have to go with that. And here is the legendary choices. So we got Moros, uh, stealth at the end of your turn, summon a 1-1 one, one steward. Destroy all minions with 5 or more attack, battle cry, and then uh, taunt at the end of your turn, add a random death at the end of your turn. Okay, let's get here. Uh, destroy... Take this, Voidwalker, we got one more card to go. All mana, summon a random minion that costs that much. This minion takes damage, deal three, and then if your opponent has six or more cards, gain charge. Forbidden. All right, here we get the Warlock Priest action going on here. Let's get into round one. All right, we got a Priest, actual Priest Mage Hero power. Actual Warlock Priest Hero power going on here, and uh, Got a lot of lifesteal type cards in my deck. So, hopefully this goes well. Very tanky. I am very tanky. Alright, and turn. Probably, it's probably gonna discover an extra lifesteal. Uh, drain life. You wanna cast a spell? I wanna cast a spell. Uh, I get to choose. Uh, discover a friendly minion that died this game. Forbidden. Smelly Give a friendly minion plus one spell damage. Interesting. Pain or I can't decide. 
How are you gonna play this? That so. That so. All right, we got four. Can't death battle give a friendly minion plus one plus one. That didn't come out so well. Yep, that's what I thought. They didn't come out well. I'm actually glad he destroyed one of his minions in the process of that. Whenever this minion takes okay. It only costs five, so it's definitely a good uh recall on that. Better not be drinking anything good. Ah, lucky, lucky, lucky. How do I want to play this? A Tuesday friendly mini and destroy it. And a no. And uh, copy a card from your opponent's deck. Nice. You got Hellfire over there? Somehow? I don't think so. I doubt it. Anything that can deal all that. Oh wait, dude. You could have... Okay, so he's got a plan. He didn't just fireball that. I was assuming he was going to fireball and kill my Wargit, but... Okay, so he's got Taunt. Interesting play there. Alright. Um... Interesting. I wonder if that was smart. I wonder if that was smart. What is going on here? No, I don't want that. So, what did you just use? I deal 5 damage to all minions except dragons. And, okay, so I just gained if you played an elemental. Alright, makes sense. No, that's not even an elemental. Huh. Alright. I don't think I have any elementals in my deck, so... What was it? If you played... At a flame gate geyser. Okay. That's gay. If an enemy is frozen, gain plus two plus two. Discovery friendly when you died. Summon it. That was kind of a waste, to be honest. If I'm gonna be honest, that was kind of a waste. I can't believe I'm a priest warlock right now. This is interesting arena. I mean, it's fun. I don't do arena that much. Alright, this is it. This is what I've been waiting for, fam. So he's going... Okay, so I have an issue here. The reason being is he's going to deal... It's going to be... Cause it's going to take a lot of damage. So I'm going to have to kill this guy myself. Five health to a minion and zero. 
I die if I don't kill it. Alright. I mean, I'm probably gonna lose because I have nothing in my hand, but I died no matter what if I killed, if I didn't kill that because it deals three damage automatically. Yeah, I lose anyway. Ah. I had really no option on that. Really? You had to heal yourself there? Well, round one with the Warlock Priest combo ain't going so well. Keep it going though. Let's keep it going. Round two. A, war a druid warrior. Interesting. Interesting. Alright, we got chat back open time. Do we get the Lich King? I wonder if Lifesteal gets affected by that card. Hearthstone's such a casual game, man. It's just like, I mean, you lose, you lose. It doesn't, I mean, I don't. It doesn't matter to me. I find this fun. And he forgot to attack him, it's amazing. It doesn't matter if he attacked or not. I was gonna heal. He doesn't know that though. one this is to spend all your mana all right. well, the reason why I summoned that is I'm assuming he's gonna go shape shift and have both of these kill and he's gonna take a nice fat four damage but I'm pretty sure you might have a card to get rid of that at the end of your turn give a random minion yeah all right that's definitely positive so how do I want to play this I don't see a point of doing that yet. I don't have a reason to kill his cards at all. Kind of hoping he kills him. Without a spell, of course. Ah, there it is. Alright, this could be bad. If he's gonna shapeshift and take 5 fat damage, I'm down. Yes? Five fat damage? Alright, take the five. That's perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. Now kill that. Ah, oh, no. That sucks. It's the same card that got the buff, so I'll take that. Um. So I do take the two damage. Fuck. Alright, I had to test it out. Otherwise, I was not gonna know. So life steal is really bad. When I have this up. Um, death audio one. That's definitely good. Thank you for that. Is it battle cry and death battle? Alright. Um, and it does too. Um, might as well, if you're gonna attack something, then attack that. No matter what, he, both of them had three health. One could lifesteal, but one can deal a lot of damage. So I'm hoping he attacks it to kill it, but he doesn't taunt after you summon a minion, gain plus one health. Alright, he's pretty easily gonna lit me up right now. Well played, bro. And it deals one to all minions, so that could help. That's definitely helpful. Um, 
What does this do? Give a random lifesteal minion in your hand plus two plus two. For sure. But wait. And then I'm gonna bypass that. That weapon destroyed him. He should not have attacked. If he didn't attack, he would have actually been safe for quite some time. Because I had no way of killing that defensive monster. And well, I mean, I did. I could have drained soul twice, but I didn't want to waste a drained soul. So him attacking with the weapon. Did some bits for me. But he's probably in the same circumstances as I am. Uh, playing with some random deck from Arena. Has no clue what he's doing. Yeah, he's thinking. He's overthinking this. That's for sure. There it is. The card that got absolutely buffed to the mix. Alright, he got a taunt card out. That's not good at all. Alright, he's about to go ham. I need an AoE card, which I don't have. Unless I picked up Twisting Nether. I did not. So, if that's the case... Ah, oh, it was, that was weird, the way that came out. Um... Go ahead and do that. That's that's actually a great play. A great play because these two can't kill this. That's gonna have to attack this unless he wants to go ahead and shape shift kill. That would be the smartest play for him. And you have taunt as well, Lish King. You're gonna be balling. Battle cry, adapt, a five four into a taunt card. Well played again. I'm I, I can't deal with the taunt cards, and he's gonna shape shift into a kill taunt, and that is perfect for him. Now I'm going to take 6, and I'm going to be at 10. Alright, well, Lish King, you're going to get one shot, fam. Actually, no, we're good. We're good, fam. Um, you're dead no matter what. Lish King, for sure. And silent. That's good enough. What did I get? Ah, uh, obliterate. Not what I wanted. Not what I wanted at all. Not what I wanted at all. If only I could have used it on that same turn. At least there is. Deal 5 damage, draw 5 cards, gain 5 armor, summon a 5-5 five, five gold. That is a real interesting card. A really terrible card, but it's a cool card, uh, none of the least. It's a very cool card. I like that. I like that. Summon. Okay. Um. Fuck. I can't even use it. I take two damage? No, I take four. Shit. Alright. Um. Alright. I want a, I want a card in my deck that costs one. Because I want to use this on 9 and not 10. I got Frostmourne. Summon every minion killed by this weapon. Ooh, summon every minion killed by this weapon. Well, that sucks. I don't want to kill anything because I don't have that much health. Ah, what am I going to do here? 5 damage to a minion or 2 to all. So we got a couple deaths. He could shapeshift kill. And that actually might be a smart play depending on the rest of his hand. I, I'm that life steal card needs to stay alive. Is he gonna shape shift kill? Because he's not gonna take that much damage. He's already got three, so he didn't take five damage. That's smart. I'm good. Perfect. Life steal is still up and running. I'm gonna use binding heal mainly because I wanted to use this on a nine cost. Didn't get what I wanted though. I got the Obsidian Statue, Taunt, Life Seal, Death Battle, Destroy, a random enemy mini. Uh, I didn't get what I wanted, but I didn't want to use it on a 10, because it's usually just going to be a giant. Uh, at least a 9 can probably pop out a legendary card that I could use. The jungle 
change form into 5-3 with stealth or 3-5 with taunt. Give it oof, that killed me. I could frost more and kill though, but that's gonna bring it back as nothing pretty much. You're gonna stay alive. I'm in a good situation right now. Very safe situation because of all the life steal I've got going on. I brought it back from one health. I want to see what he says. Does it do the warlock greeting? I think, yeah, I won. I don't know what I was thinking there. I was overthinking that. Alright, got one win so far in Arena. That's uh, usually my average. My average is one. The Holy One. Let's get into round three. That's just how, that's just how often I play Warlock. I don't know if I could have gotten a better starting hand right there. Interesting starting hand. This is actually good. And then this uh, opponent here is playing Mage Road. That's cool. I mean, that's a stabby mage. The mage is coming in the melee fan. Interesting. Come on. Really? You didn't have to. Don't attack with your minion. Yes. Oh, thank you. What is real? You gotta prepare, fam. Get them. Gotta build them walls. Walls for days. Gonna summon another weapon. Ah, that's exactly what I wanted. Now you can't do anything. Walls for days. Hey, did I say walls for days or did I say walls for freaking life? I'm not letting you kill anything, bro. I wrote, dude. That's the coolest name I've ever seen on this lately. Pyrokinesis, Fire Psychic. And then we got a rogue mage. This is this is confusing the hell out of me. Destroy all enemies, gain plus one percent attack. A rogue mage is so confusing. Should have probably killed his minion. What does this do? Copy three cards in your opponent's deck. Add them into your hand. Definitely gonna be used next turn. Hopefully, I get some good stuff. Hopefully, I get his one or two, one of his legendaries. Oh, hitting me up. Clear that. So, he's gonna kill. But that's still alive. No! Terrible. I'm gonna have to drain soul. I can't use that card now. Yeah, I'm gonna have to drain soul. That's eight. Actually, no, he's gonna take the damage. If it plays out correctly, he's gonna take the damage. So now I am a mage, priest, and a rogue, and a warlock. Rogue, priest. No. Rogue, mage, priest, warlock. I got all four classes over here, fam. I'm four classing. This, do you think dual class was enough? A quad class. Quad. Name of the video. Quad class in arena. Dude, kill my worgen. Are you joking me right now? Don't kill the murloc. Kill the worgen. Damn it. Alright, you got a way to get out of this now. He's got a spell that's going to get rid of my worgen. That's AIDS. My shield for yep, there it is. AIDS. Give a random nope. 
um, definitely gonna use that that part. Yeah, throw a that part out there. I got so much healing abilities. It's uh, I'm pretty in a good spot right here. Add two one one skelly. Um, do I sheep or do I silence or do I chill? Right now, I think I'm chilling. Um, yeah, let's do that instead. Could silence, but I don't feel it. It's not gonna die yet. If I have to silence, I will. Alright, so does the same stuff. Ooh, you can destroy the pumpkin. Wait, what did you just do? Ah, oh, eggs. Alright, this isn't going well anymore. I've just been voided. I want that board to fill up. Let's put it that way. That is absolutely terrible. So they basically, it's the same, they just made it look a little bit, um, a little bit more war, uh, warlocky, a little bit more hollow zandy, with like a, a griffin that's spectral, got spider looking emblem over here, got pumpkins that we can squash, but everything else stayed the same. This is the one that increases, yeah this is not good. Are you joking? That costs zero, huh? Alright, you gain plus five health for each elemental you played last turn. And then equip a T sh does it does it actually equip it? It doesn't, does it? So kind of you to join me. Doesn't equip shit. Alright, well that sucks. Now he gets to summon something really nice. I actually hope he uses it. Thank you. Oh no, it has zero. Never mind. I thought it was. I was hoping he used it so he wasted mana. Never seen this. You got eight damage to all minion. Oh, really? All of that just to make me look and feel bad and take another L. Well, it looks like we gotta try to bounce back. 2 3. Firefly's lit, Shadow lit, and this is a great, I mean, a great hand, and uh, considering it's the order, I'm probably gonna play these cards in. We got a Mage Warrior, so the, another melee. Whoa, another melee mage. What's up with these melee mages today? Is uh, Blizzard trying to tell us something? Your opponent turned. I mean, that's sad. Uh... Now, uh, the only reason why I played this, I'm hoping he kills it because I don't want to be killing this on my turn. But I'm assuming he won't kill it, so that's kind of also a good thing. No matter which way, that that card's going to come in handy, unless he's a spell that will get rid of it. And if that's the case, like that, I'm going to be upset.
Okay, you don't have anything that's gonna destroy that, do you? Alright. Interesting. I will go ahead and kill it. Because I feel confident now with that card that I just drew that I have some turns to deal with. Uh, well, no, 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 no. Watch what's gonna come next. And I feel it coming because I know this is gonna come. A whirlwind. Yep, there it is. Fucking hell. I knew it. Called it. Aged it. That's my luck though in this game. So what did I just get? Mana bind when your opponent casts a spell. Add a copy to your hand. Uh, zero. Taunt 2-6 Stegadone and sleep with the fishes. Deal 3 damage to all damage. Alright, please get it out. Attack and get it out for me. Is this a 1-2 one, or 1-1? One, one? It's 1-2, one, so that's actually good. Yes. It's gonna attack, and it's gonna die. I'm fine with that. Is that all you can do? Sweet. Alright. Uh, life seal. I already had that turn in mind. Um, I forget what the darkness does. Green control, okay, and then this is summon a really lit card. This is good in arena because it gives you versatility onto the circumstances that you're in, so I just got something really good. What was it? Random minion taunt. Oh, wow. Thanks. That was your random minion? You all damaged me. Uh, okay. Ooh, what am I gonna do here? Is the question. I oh yes, boys. I have to. I had kind of had to. I have no dragons, which is that stuff. So. You have sheep. If you have sheep, I'll, I'm just gonna say GG, and I'm gonna take the L. Oh. Okay, that's better than sheep, isn't it? That's just much better than sheep. Watch, I hope. You know what? I can get rid of that. I can get rid of this card. You're gonna see. You're gonna see some glory. I'll figure it out. Deal one damage. Oh, I see. Makes total sense. I might, I think so. <laughs> I think so, I'm gonna use it on it. Uh, I think I'm safe for a turn. Yeah, I need to try to help my Deathwing out. And Deathwing summons dragons? Ah, uh, yeah, I got no dragons in the stack at all. Gul'dan, let's work with the, uh, the other- Dude, I've got Deathwing, Gul'dan, and Lich King in one deck. We've got- Freaking, what do you call it? Wrath of the Lich King, Cataclysm, and Warlords of Draenor with Legion. So we got four expansions with some endgame bosses in one deck. Really? Oh, that's a horse. Oh no. Better than sheep, what did I say? What did I say, boys? I'm trying to do it a different way. I don't. I'm trying to save Lich King. 
that his Lich King can get one shot from this Deathwing. Again, this was very fun, and I say was mainly because I probably already lost. Plus three attack. I can handle that. And taunt. I can handle that. This is actually good. I can handle that. Perfect. Oh, fuck. I can't handle it. I can't handle it because now this is in my way. Taunt card of hell. Might as well. <sighs> I can't take that card. Oh, actually, I could. Obliterate would only deal three damage if I kill Deathwing, but. Deathwing's gonna have to kill. You, you, you win, bro. Yeah, that's what I thought. You win. You just attack face. I was like, wait, what is he taking so long? But. Ah, we went one and three. Well, there's next week, and there is going to be next week, because we get another free ticket next week. So let's go ahead and check out what we get for this week. That was fun. It was interesting. Let me know what you think down below in the comment section if you guys want to see some more Hearthstone videos, and what do you want to see. Uh, let's go ahead and adventure into We got another pack for Frozen Throne, and we got 35 deaths. So without further ado, thank you all very much for tuning in, and peace out.